hey guys, we're here in A1. And I'm talking about what Phil Spencer said. Now, for those of you who don't know, Phil Spencer is the head of Xbox. And he was basically trying to reassure people that just because the game is cross-gen, which means that it's going to come out on both the Xbox One and the Xbox Series X, doesn't mean that the quality will suffer, right? And Rich from Review Tech USA basically seemed to agree with him. But I don't fully. What I mean is that I understand, yes, he was comparing it to PC tech, how a game can still run great on the high-end PC, even though it is able to run on the lower-end PC, right? This is true. But there is usually a difference between cross-gen games and games that were meant specifically for one console. Now, it is also partly to do, I believe, with developers not being too familiar with the hardware at the beginning and them getting more familiar with it as it goes on. But I do think cross-gen games does have some effect. Just like the difference is that you can't optimize a game for PC like that because you have to make sure it plays on different levels of different PCs. But you can optimize a game for a console because you're just making it for that console. But if you have to do cross-gen, I don't think a lot of developers are going to take full advantage of the Xbox Series X hardware if they also have to make a version for the Xbox One. Now, this happens basically every generation, I believe. I mean, remember how games looked on 360 when they first came out? Yes, like I said, that does have to do with developers, I think, getting more familiar with the hardware as time goes on. But still, I do believe that cross-gen gaming has a slight effect on how well a game looks on the console because developers have to basically split development time on developing both versions of the game. And I'm not saying anything's wrong with that. They're still going to probably look great on the Xbox Series X and run really well. But I don't think we're going to get like those full 4K Xbox Series X games until after developers start to just focus on basically the Xbox Series X. Yes, obviously the PS5 as well. But I mean, just focus on those next consoles as opposed to focusing on the PS4 and the Xbox One. But what do you guys think? Do you guys think there will be any significant effect in the games because they have to support cross-gen for, I think, at least the first year, maybe even longer? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. May God bless you all.